but I, I struggle with like, I'm not needed in my business as much as we've created this idea that I'm needed, right? Like people believe that they need me and I've spent the last 14 years convincing them that they need me. And so there's this addiction to me personally when it's like, if I could get you to work with this coach, this coach knows everything that I know. And then like, boom, we can scale. So I'm like, that's kind of like this, this place I'm in right now. So we spend, you know, eight to 10 years of our career convincing people we're the guy. Yeah, yeah. Then we get to a point where we've got so many clients, we can't be the guy for everybody. And we have to convince them that there's another guy, right? And that other person might actually be better than you. Just, and, and I'm not saying they are, but they don't have the presence or the, the accolades or the marketing as you being the front man. So we tend to think as the owner that they're, they're relying on us, but the client doesn't fucking know. And you're like a king. And if you say this person's a knight and you hit them with the sword and they're the ones that go out and give the battle, the commands to the army, and they're the ones that go out there and give the, the instructions to the army, right? Then the army doesn't go, oh, I only need the king. The army's like, okay, I'm with the knight.